Lou is the Kevin Speaks, Vegeta's Pain, Vegeta's Pain. First and foremost, shout out to all of the Saiyans, man. Worldwide, everybody a part of the calisthenic slash weightlifting community who goes out, puts in that pain, develops, sharpens, curates, carves out, and all of those good words to describe shaping the type of physique that you want, right? Because it's incredibly important to understand the connection to fitness, discipline, the way that we carry ourselves, the way that we present ourselves, right? And everything else. I believe everything correlates. So without further ado, <clears throat> Today, I wanted to talk to you all about something I've been contemplating, right? We're going to call it Vegeta's Contemplations. And what I've been contemplating is patience, right? So I'm an Aries, right? So for me, patience is something that I actually struggle with personally, right? And I know in and along a spectrum, I don't think there's anybody that's 100% patient. I just think some people are more patient than others, right? But we all may fall into a slump or we all may fall into a sort of space where we can't wait for the things that we've poured energy and time into to come into fruition. So first and foremost, let me say, I appreciate your eagerness. I support the earnestness and I support the idea of being so excited, right? That you can't wait to start doing the things that you imagine you should be doing right or you can't wait to implement certain things what i want to say is patience is something that i've been forced to contend with i've been forced for anybody who has an idea <clears throat> you understand it has to be broken down into phases right for anybody who sets a goal for themselves right one of the first things we need to understand is that there is no such thing as an automatic or a right away or a next day, right? There are short-term goals that you can set for yourself and you can accomplish quickly, but there are going to be a lot of things, especially if you're dreaming and thinking big enough, there's going to be a lot of things that require time and patience. And even in these planning stages, right? That's the monotonous work. Those are the things that happen, right? Over and over and over, but it's the things that become monotonous, that become tedious. Those are the things that we have to perfect those are the things that we have to pour the time and energy into so how does that translate back to patience patience is needed in my humble opinion in every stage and phase of developing an idea planning an idea or manifesting or bringing anything into fruition so allow me to reiterate that and rephrase that patience is necessary anytime you want to manifest and or bring something into fruition. Patience is needed because unless it's an immediate goal that can be solved right away, right, with the resources you have available to you at any given moment, whatever that may be, you're going to have to be patient. And in and along the different phases, patience is gonna be required. And if you're someone who's not prone, right, or you don't sort of have a proclivity for being patient, is that much more important for you to emphasize the importance of it. Because a lot of the times we can't address something until we acknowledge and recognize the importance of it. That's what I've sort of found, right? So when we take accountability for ourselves, when we're doing our self edits, when we're looking at how we can develop and better ourselves, quite frankly, it always starts, in my humble opinion, with a self-assessment. And then you have to look at the various things that you're doing. And then you have to acknowledge where it is that you can improve and what it is that you can start doing better on a day-to-day -day basis. And a lot of people suffer from being impatient, myself included. I have goals, I have dreams, I have aspirations. Gargantuan, right? Herculean dreams. How is it that we bring those things into fruition? How is it that we manifest those things? All of these are the things that we have to consider on a day-to-day -day basis. So please, please remember, right? When considering bringing any major dream, goal, endeavor, or anything into this space, we have to use patience, but we should deploy patience, right? Strategically, purposely, with intention, 
right? It's not just enough <clears throat> in my mind to be patient, right? You want to intentionally deploy patience, especially if patient, if you're not a patient person to begin with, right? So please hop up in the comments. Let me know what you thought about the video topic. If you have any questions, anything you'd like me to cover, right? Or you want to disagree respectfully, of course, I'd appreciate that, right? Hop up in the comments. Let me know your thoughts, the importance of patience to you, and how is it that you utilize patience in your everyday in order to manifest and or bring things into fruition, right? So with that being said, as always, I, nothing but love for y'all, man. Thank you for the time that it took to deliver this message sincerely, right? Y'all have a wonderful and blessed Friday and an even better weekend and much love. And until next time, salute.